<laughs> okay, jeg er klart. Welcome back. <laughs> det er skidisk. You wanna do that again? <laughs> no. No. I n- okay. nailed it. Uh, episode 11. We recorded on the 28th of the February 2022. Hello. So sweaty. Yeah, we we are Isha and tiny hats Isha or gang. tiny hats and Isha gang thing. Yeah, what are we talking oh, about? We've just had a sweaty hour. <laughs> yeah, of the, yeah. Uh, stuff. <laughs> oh, stuff. <laughs> what what did we talk about this episode? Summarize. <clears throat> so you summarize. Uh, okay, we talk about me having COVID, not clickbait, and we talk about <laughs> f- <laughs> food f- fetishes and how it is to YouTube. We talk about what we are playing currently, as we always do. Also, Elden Ring snuck itself into it. <laughs> as it does. <laughs> we, talk, we talk about Munchausen by proxy. That is sick. And sick. we give you a lot of random facts. <laughs> <laughs> and we talk about how Patrick crashed your car. He did. It's yeah. true. <laughs> and we talk about age also. Yeah. And we started out so well. It was going so well. And like this episode just deteriorates as time goes on. <laughs> this is the best <laughs> episode by far. <laughs> you say that every week. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I'm so sick. You feel fine. <laughs> I'm sweaty. <laughs> okay. Well. I am. Episode 11 of Disky Disc. Enjoy it. Okay. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> recording in progress do you have any <laughs> feedback from last week's episode as usual i have not read the comments since like the day after it was uploaded <laughs> hold on <laughs> we never do we never do let this keep i made a few notes okay i'm gonna wing it hold on <laughs> i'm gonna wing it <laughs> i love uh, winging it okay the c- comments are boring they're all just saying that chrissy is awesome <laughs> <laughs> our guest <laughs> she was uh, awesome Okay, what's, what do you have? And then I'll try to look for something. I just wanted to say that we have a <laughs> Easter egg ending in the last episode, an episode yes. 10 on YouTube. And I surprised you, even. I, I loved it. It was super <laughs> funny. <laughs> if you go to the end of the video, you will see some Easter egg funny things. Was, was funny. that in the audio, too? Like in the audio version? Or was it just on YouTube? <laughs> audio version, too. <laughs> <laughs> so they get to the end and there's just a bunch yeah. of unsubtitled narration. Yeah. Yeah, just yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I thought it was funny though. When I got to the end, I was I was howling. I was like, lol. <laughs> it was good. Just funny things. Fun, really. Easter okay. egg. I have two more notes. I can go over mm-hmm. them quickly. I wrote down mm-hmm. Tiny doesn't remember one week ago, but remembers everything that Isha <laughs> did and said and wore at age 16. <laughs> <laughs> This is something you said. <laughs> Yeah, well, look, like it. it's that's my early onset dementia, you know? That's what happens <laughs> with people when they have dementia. They remember their childhood. They don't remember last yeah, week. Yeah, but, but I'm like that too. I remember a bunch of things that happened like in my teenage years. Yep. I should yep. really start listening to last week's podcast like before we do the current podcast because uh, I don't know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> you wrote something in this notes. You said I did. Questions. Yeah, go. You, you just said you had two more, but then... <laughs> <laughs> so that was mine. I, was I, mine. I snuck it in there. Yeah, you did. Um, no, I just thought maybe we should uh, like ask, do people like guests or is that like super lame? Can people like... <laughs> is, is it super lame? Did you think Christy was lame? Is Christy lame? Yes or no? Leave your comment down below. <laughs> <laughs> no, <I'm joking. laughs> I love you, Christy, and your laugh. That was a good one. No, feedback. Do we have any comments that we want to shout out? Um... T- Do you have it? Do you have yeah. it open? I have. Do you have it? <laughs> Do you have them open now? Uh, yes. What? <laughs> <laughs> All of them are just about Christy. Oh, best. wait. Wait, this, this one was funny. Uh, uh, Hosier Rail Rider said, uh, I feel like you chicks are the ones that, uh, that deal with the stalkers. A guy would uh, just be like, so I met this chick. We're in a relationship now. <laughs> oh, yeah, that one. <laughs> That's like. what people do. 
<laughs> yeah <laughs> like same like Un- unplug me already saying i'm just imagining me my squiggly fingers like worms yeah squiggly <laughs> fingers it's when you squi- <laughs> squiggle your where do you have that from squiggly fingers i don't know because when you squiggle something it's when you go up and squiggle like when you squig when you squiggle <laughs> What does it mean? It means to squiggle, to go squig like a worm squiggles. I don't know. What is yeah. squiggle? Squiggle definition. Squiggle. But squiggly fingers. So that is like I'm not completely sure, but let's go with it anyway. Sort of thing. Isn't squiggle it? Squiggle definition. Isn't a that short line? Uh, squiggle. A short line that curls and loops in an irregular way. <laughs> Your Wriggle or squirm. <laughs> yeah, because when you do quotations, you know, like air quotation marks. Yeah. Yeah, you know? yeah, true. Yeah, because when you're on the internet and you're talking to somebody on voice chat, they can't see you do squiggly fingers. Yeah, you know? true. Yeah, like when you talk to somebody, <laughs> you just go wah, wah, with your fingers. <laughs> you have to tell how you say, you know you have to say yeah. how your body language is. Smiling, yeah. <laughs> lulling out loud, laughing, <laughs> lul, lulzing. <laughs> Have yeah. you seen that meme where it's like a, a teenager that has no facial expression and he says, LOL, I'm laughing out loud, literally, <laughs> like super low. Yeah, that's that, when you that say... That never happens. Yeah, because you can translate it. When you say just LOL, you're just, you might have smiled slightly. <laughs> and if you say, <laughs> and if you say, ha ha, or you might have also probably not really smiled, you're just kind of politely saying possibly funny. But if you say, ha ha ha, then you might have gone like... <clears throat> Yeah, you yeah, know. true, true. But when but, the caps lock comes up, yeah. and it's hard <laughs> I was about to say it. I use caps lock when I actually laugh, like yeah, L M A O X E X E X E. That is when it's an actual yeah. laugh. When the L O L is capitalized, that's when it's actual laughing. <laughs> Lol. We say lol in real life, don't we? We always have ever since we have we done were since born. 2004. <laughs> yeah, really super lame to be honest <laughs> super lols and we pronounce it in Norwegian too instead of saying lol we just say lol lol, lol. <laughs> lol. I know I say it in my videos also I say lol, lol. <laughs> so lol. terrible like cringy lol lol yeah. I literally do still say it though like it's kind of a thing that you're supposed to only say when you're like a preteen but I still say it <laughs> I will say it forever <laughs> lol eight years old lol lol <laughs> And my nurses, when I am 80, they will be like, oh, that generation. <laughs> the emo scene queen generation. Like <laughs> millennials. <laughs> they are LOLing. <laughs> There's oh, probably God. something else in 2060. Well, it won't be as good as LOL. <laughs> LOLs. <laughs> it will never be better than LOLs. Were there any other good comments? I mean, everybody liked Christy, right? <laughs> yeah, that was it. That was it. <laughs> <laughs> that was all the comments good job christy yay yeah yeah good. that's good stuff i laughed a lot i liked it <laughs> <laughs> i did laugh i did it lol was, in real I, life same it was capital letters <laughs> caps lock <laughs> lol <laughs> that was episode 10 cool yeah good. very good this is episode 11 yeah how yeah. do you feel about that how do you feel about that i feel like i have corona <laughs> <laughs> that's true should we talk about it yeah we can talk about it okay yeah, like one hour ago, I figured out I figured, <laughs> I figured out that I have corona. No, I'm gonna give you the real story. Yes, I do have corona right now, fresh out of the <laughs> test, fresh COVID. <laughs> I have the fresh COVID right now, super fresh, and you can hear that I'm I'm well, I'm fine, I'm feeling good. Yep. You know, and no symptoms has kicked in. I don't know if they will. I hope they won't. Should we admit that we're recording this on Monday because we have to record it today in case you're dead tomorrow? <laughs> or, or are we going to record yep. it today and upload yep. it? Tomorrow? We panicked. We panicked. We were like, <laughs> oh no, the podcast. <laughs> it's going to be the last podcast. It's She's going to die. Doomed. Yeah, it's going to be doomed. We have to record oh, it before no. you get sick. Yeah, that's how important Disc Disc is. Okay, so the theory of the corona in this household is that uh, <laughs> all the um, colleagues of Isha Man. They have recently, super recently gotten it. And yep. today, uh, Ishaman started having symptoms and he took a test. It was super two lines of redness. <laughs> Such a test. <laughs> <Yeah>. Absolutely <laughs> positive. <Yeah. laughs> super positive. It was like blood, old blood red. Like the vampire red. <laughs> You're doing a very good job explaining that. Thank you. There's a super real visualization right now. <laughs> 
<laughs> that's how sick he was and i'm like oh my god i live with you we kiss so, so i'm like oh, no. <laughs> we kiss i probably have it too then i took another t- and then i took a test anyhow i had like two slight like not as vampire red lines but they were there <laughs> they were there, like watered down blood <laughs> like <know>. bad covid <laughs> 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 like the not so hardcore version of covid gotcha but it means that i'm positive it mean you yeah. know if if it's only like two slight uh lines you have a positive coronas oh yeah it doesn't take anything you know uh my friend that i work with um mm. she when she took her positive her positive test her covid test <laughs> and like the 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 first line you know there's one line that's always yeah. the line and then yeah. the second line was like it was like you needed almost a microscope to see it oh, kind God. of thing but then she took another one the next day and that one was like you know now it's it's real now <laughs> it's yeah happening. yeah but it's a positive one if you can slightly see a line it's sad so yeah. in the yeah. instructions instruction manual <laughs> i was so excited i was like i'm gonna synthesize this <laughs> test like in atelier so, so excited pregnancy know. test for your nose i think yeah we yeah that at one point. <laughs> true I mean, what can you do? It's the pandemic. We gotta have some LOL caps lock with it. <laughs> I mean, everyone's gonna get it. You know, my landlord has it too. Actually, oh, I talked you know to her what? yesterday. Everyone has it now. Like the the last week in Hoshtabu, <laughs> in Hoshtabu, <laughs> <laughs> in our city. I mean, everyone has gotten it. Like this, yeah, yeah. the past days now. Now is the enormous, you know, breakout in our city. Yeah, because I told you last was it last week? You said, uh, can can I come over one day and like make a vlog or like a QA and something? Yeah, just like a home vlog, whatever. Yeah. And I said, Well, I mean, I can't really res- risk getting COVID because like all of my colleagues, like the last two weeks, we've been like on rotation <laughs> getting COVID. <laughs> Poor thing. <laughs> oh no. So, so Besides, it's like been should, a really shit should, time. Yeah, you should really not get it though. And we do have some patients now that are positive. Oh, so bad. Yeah. Well, it's uh, good times all around, I suppose. What can we do? We can do our best. That's what we can do, I guess. I mean, everyone's going to get it. It's fine. Yeah, like a couple of podcasts back, I said have you gotten it yet and you said no and i said no and then we said we will net ne- we will net be surprised <laughs> we net we net that's net. how we said it yeah. we will net get surprised if we get- <laughs> <laughs> no like it wouldn't surprise me i said <laughs> yeah and then here we are that was like two weeks ago and now your dream has become reality <laughs> oh no i did not want this well you have it i've been an unsocial person that's only at home so yeah you know, I, I have not provoked this result i <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Well, you know but here we are i have it fine yeah. i well, hope i don't get the symptoms uh yeah but because it's possible that you won't <sighs> i will probably be super sick tomorrow well don't say that now you've jinxed it okay sorry <laughs> knock on wood or something <laughs> Do you think you will get it? Yeah, at some point. It will not be surprised. It will not be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> but it's been, you know, because uh, Patrick, you know, Patrick isn't COVID uh, vaccinated, which he is being on Wednesday. Hooray. Everybody clap for Patrick and his COVID yeah. vaccination that That's, he will be getting. Isn't that sort of scary? Not being vaccinated, I mean. Oh, I thought you said to get the vaccine. <laughs> so no, I, I love vaccines. You Maybe know? to love them. Um, <laughs> I said so. I, I mean, you're them. gonna have to. You're gonna have to ask him. I don't know. <laughs> it's Do mostly you... because he's going to the Netherlands, though, and he has to yeah. travel, and you need to blah blah blah. Yeah. <laughs> so true. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sweet. That's good. Enjoy. I, I hope you don't you... die, though. I, I hope you guys don't get it. <laughs> you hope I don't die. <laughs> Wait, who's gonna? Maybe we should open like an application process for who's gonna co-host a disky disc if you die. Like somebody's gonna have to take your place. Can you do that after I, you know, go to the ghostly side? I mean, it's better to be, you know, prepared. <laughs> Christy can take over our last yeah. guest. <laughs> oh, true. Actually, you have to step up, Christy, with yeah. the creaminess that you yeah. like. Yep, you're gonna have to take over. <laughs> I really <laughs> do not have to die now, or else. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Disky Disc. Poor you. <laughs> Kidding. Love you. <laughs> Disky Disc will be, oh no, not capitalized LOL. 
<laughs> it will be lowercase lol dot dot lowercase. dot oh, like, no. like the cringe version of lol <laughs> <laughs> dot, dot, dot. that's when it's like serious you know that's <laughs> that when is why like... i do not approve that's lol yeah. lowercase dot 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 yeah lol. that's like dot, now dot, you're dot. just being stupid that is what yeah. it means yeah <laughs> the dot 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 really tells it all <laughs> true, true. Okay. Oh, I ripped a page out of my bookie book. Oh no, your bookie book. Oh no, my bookie book. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wing it. Yeah, wing it. Come on, I'm waiting. We we have a, a topic for the <laughs> episode on the podcast. Groundbreaking. Yeah. <laughs> the topic. <laughs> the topic. The topic is how it is to YouTube, and uh-huh. we mean this question for tiny hats <laughs> <laughs> how is it to youtube do you love it no this one this one's all you <laughs> uh yeah do you have any questions about oh that? yeah because i had something that i wrote down because last week you told the stalker story mm-hmm. so like uh, i wanted to do this topic this week because it was relevant to last week because i was thinking about it like that stalker thing guy so stalker you know squiggly fingers <laughs> <laughs> lowercase yeah. lol yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Capitalize that well. Um, <laughs> that was a pretty weird thing, right? But like, have you ever had any other super weird things happen? Like, has anybody ever like uh, asked to see pictures of your feet or like? Yep. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. I think uh, I have gotten like at least five times in DM on Instagram and now everyone is going to do it. <laughs> Everyone's <laughs> going to slide into my DMs and it's like, Can, do you have pictures of your feet? Can really? I buy them? Do oh, you have no. any? <laughs> no, oh, no. I don't respond. But once I responded, like what? And I, I was like, I don't know. I was in the mood. <laughs> I was like, what? why do you want them or something like that like legit curious like what's the deal with this uh and he got kind of offended he was like i i can't explain this so i like feet uh are you trying to make fun of me he said back oh and i was like no i'm I'm not trying to make fun of you but then i was like god i don't know anything about this uh, topic let's say it's it's a topic (laughs) that we have heard about but we just shrug and lowercase lol to it but i googled it and it's like something that people just can't help i think according well, yeah, to it's a fe- it's a fetish yeah yeah what? a weird one but yeah i mean it's it weird a... if you don't have that but yeah. then again some people like trees i've heard some about people them. like some people like poop you know oh god yeah In, yeah so there are a lot there's of things. all sorts of things people can like yeah and uh That's... <laughs> they just can't help it according to yeah. google citation needed <laughs> i don't know <laughs> so yeah that was that was one of the weird things that happens but it doesn't happen like a lot why is it the what why is it the feet people though why is there the feet people (laughs) (laughs) trademark um (laughs) don't know why is it not like i mean i'm sure people have like ear fetishes and like i don't know like hand fetishes or like something yeah nails and hands do you ever is feet the only one you've ever gotten um i've also gotten people that said uh my my hands look good (laughs) i guess (laughs) but I don't know. No, not really. I I don't get a lot of creeps in my DMs. Actually, mm. I don't know why. People are normal for most mostly. Um, Have you ever I, actually? Oh no, carry on. I can't think carry of on. anything else weirdly from the because I I remember reading about one of the people that I uh, follow who um, does uh, wow videos. Mm-hmm. Uh, she said that for a while it was uh, she played a uh, console a bit on her stream and whatever. And when she did that, she had like a stint into the console world when she took a break from wow, I guess. Uh, and in that time, she had several DMs from people asking if she <laughs> what <laughs> asking if she must with the controller when it vibrates. <laughs> what? I've never done that. <laughs> never heard about that. I've never gotten that. And I d- believe that she might have been scarred from the console <laughs> community forever. Because <laughs> that's just creepy. Well, I don't yeah. know what to say about that. Sorry yeah. for her and everyone. Everybody should slide into <laughs> everybody should slide into your DMs and ask you that now. <laughs> that was just weird though. Just weird. Nah. Yeah.
Have you gotten anything weird? No, I, mean, I want doesn't, It doesn't have to be YouTube related. Yeah. No, I I never get anything weird. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Everything's normal. <laughs> Everything you get is normal. Yeah. 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 It's normal. But do you ever get like normal and no- normal <laughs> squiggly fingers? <laughs> like not the foot people and not the hand people and not the vibrating controller people. But do you ever get people who are just like, show me your boobies? No, but OK, I remember something now. Uh, people occasionally, maybe once a year, I get the question, do you have OnlyFans? Oh, well, that's yeah, not so bad. But, but nothing like other than that. They they say it like, do you have OnlyFans? Are you planning on getting an OnlyFans? I would like to see blah, 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 OnlyFans. That is the <laughs> one. That is the, the only one that I can think uh-huh. of. Yeah. Wow. And no, I will never <laughs> get an OnlyFans. <laughs> Sorry. No, that is so not me. But you've literally never had anybody ever be like, hey, want to be my girlfriend? Show me your boobs or no. anything? No weird why are the foot people so like up front <laughs> i've gotten like five over the past five years like what that what means, is that <laughs> i don't i wouldn't say that i'm bombarded by feet people <laughs> so it's just, bombarded by foot <laughs> no it's just so rarely and random and i i don't really think about it <laughs> It's a bit weird, though, considering that, like, foot fetish, like, feet and whatever, it's, like, a sexual thing for them. So it's, you know, there are several people into feet who are willing to ask you for foot pictures, mm-hmm. but there are no normal creeps just asking you for booby pictures. Isn't that no. a bit weird? You'd think the people who want to see yeah. boobies kind of outweighs the amount of people who just want to see feet. I don't know. Maybe they are thinking, like, if I ask this girl <laughs> if she want to create an OnlyFans, it's more likely than if I, you know just ask directly i don't know you know oh, maybe there are more maybe there are more foot <laughs> now i'm gonna get a lot think. of <laughs> i don't know no I've, i'm i'm just lucky i guess i never get a lot of weird weirdness okay but Fair now enough. i will definitely get now that. you will definitely. <laughs> no dms are open <laughs> no <laughs> no, no i will never take feet pictures i will never make it only fun. it's not my thing i review games that's it and i have this TV's podcast i'm satisfied you okay know. The, the, the podcast is all you need you don't need it it's just too hot not to <laughs> it's too hot not to <laughs> true <laughs> all you need really yep yep we are providing <laughs> Uh, okay um, so back to the actual topic that was all like, just because the stalker story came up last week that's why i thought of this and that's why i bolded how is it to youtube <laughs> yeah how is it to youtube i like it obviously you can't do it without liking it at least liking it you have to love mm-hmm. it is what i'm regularly thinking to myself this is this is not a thing to do if you don't love it <laughs> because there's just so much work a ton of editing planning and getting ready and equipment and stuff it's a lot it's a lifestyle <laughs> it's, a it's a lifestyle not a game it is um, <laughs> yeah but isn't yeah, that hard absolutely. to like think of video ideas no that's what i feel would be no, the hardest i have too many i scrap a lot of them you know i have hmm. a bookie book a script book you can see it in all my videos and i write a lot of videos that never happens you know hmm. because i you know i just i have scrapped a lot of uh, reviews already actually i remember ages ago you said you were going to make a, a review for luigi's mansion 2 and you never did <laughs> i, I still did remember i say that <laughs> yeah oh no <laughs> I luigi's remember. mansion 2 that is on the 3ds well, yeah. no luigi's mansion no, the one that's on the switch three, three. yeah fine i did three, make whatever. a review of that link in did the you? discord yeah i can link oh, really? in the discord. Damn. Yeah, yeah but i i spent like half a year getting that out okay so here i've been holding a grudge for a review i thought you didn't make but then you did make it <laughs> yeah i did make it what really? i haven't made yet is the witcher 3 review Oh, okay. remember in 2019, <laughs> you said, well, in uh, 2023, you will make it or oh. 2024. So I have a couple of years to do it you, still. You do have some time yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because that is such a game. It is such a game. <laughs> yeah. And the Switch version, though. Oh, my God. It's terrible. It's not mm. the good one. No. I will continue. Maybe if I'm gonna play Witcher Three, I will do it on PC. I was gonna no. say now you can play it on your super sexy hot <laughs> new computer. Yes, yes. PC gaming, the PC, PC life. Game. You're a PC master race. Oh, I only play WoW on the computer. Now. <laughs> You're a WoW master race. WoW master race. It's a lifestyle, <laughs> not a game. Am I right, shampoo? 
Um, <laughs> it looks like Graveyard Keeper. It does, though, sometimes. <laughs> sometimes, looks like. Yeah. But you you have converted over the past years over to Switch and consoles in general. Not, How do you not feel until, about that? Not to the Switch, though. The only thing I play on the Switch now, like I played Atelier uh, Ryza too, mm-hmm. and then I played Sophie too. Other than that, the only thing I play on my Switch is Cooking Tycoon. And Stardew Valley? <laughs> No, I don't play. I play Stardew Valley on the uh, Series X. Okay, so how is Cooking Ty Ty Kian? It's good. I like it. <laughs> See, it's a good game. It's a good game. <laughs> it's a good game. Yeah. I mean, I like time sink stressy management games, so it's it passes the time. Nice. nice. Uh, multiplayer, single player. No single player. <laughs> it's like <laughs> literally, I'll show it to you after. It's like a really. I'll link it in the Discord. Actually, it's a super <laughs> simple game. <laughs> cool. Yeah. But I don't play. I was actually talking to Patrick about this. Like, like there aren't really any Nintendo franchises I like. And by not really, I mean there what? isn't. <laughs> what? Yeah. But you are now an Atelier super fan. Mm-hmm. But that's not a Switch game. I just play it on the Switch. Yeah, true. It's everywhere. I mean, PC, PS4, Switch. True. So, what yeah. do you think about Atelier Sophie too? We can now <laughs> finally talk about it. I remember <laughs> someone said like you have been talking about it for several podcast episodes that you cannot talk about it. When will you actually talk about it? When will we actually talk about it? Well, you made your review already. Like, yeah, I did. Yep. <laughs> Video but, review on my channel. Yeah, I agreed pretty much with uh, pr- most of the <laughs> things. Did you disagree on anything then? I, um, there was something, but I didn't write it down, and now I've forgotten. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did you like the synthesizing? Not as much. I thought it was better in Ryza, but I didn't True. really love it in Ryza either. So technically I did um it was better in Ryza. I, I, I agree. Better in Ryza. How about the turn based combat thingy? I mean, I feel like about the synth the synthesization, which I'm sure <laughs> is not a word. <laughs> the synthesizing. <laughs> Alchemy. But yeah, but in the Sophie too, that there must be some way to, you know, get good, as they say. Get good. Yeah. <laughs> but I have yet to discover how to get good at it. Like, the because I tried for a while. I tried to, like, compare auto, like, the thingies, the, like, traits and whatever that you get from autosynthesis. And then I tried to, like, puzzle it together myself and try to, like, reach that level or better and i was just like i can't do it the ai is smarter than me oh no <laughs> yeah i'm not a fan <laughs> of the synthesizing either so i'm auto synthesizing i said so in the review i still do it yeah unless i really have to have a trait because of a quest that's the only mm. that's the one yeah yeah it's- it just seems there seems to be no reason to do it because you discover uh Synthesis, synthesization, synthesis. <laughs> Your favorite the word. Of, yeah, it's, it's a, that is a weird name. That's a weird um, name. A, a different way in Sophie too, right? In uh, Ryza, you get the, the uh, you have to like put certain amounts of materials to get to like the node that gives you a recipe. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. And then in Sophie too, it's a different way. It it's a different game. <laughs> It's a but it doesn't game, have, really. I know, I know. <laughs> but it doesn't have anything to do with synthesizing to find more ways to synthesize. You find more ways to synthesize in other ways than by synthesizing. <laughs> right. That's so <laughs> if you know what I mean. Yeah. I love yeah. it. The graphics yeah. are so cute, pretty. They are cute. Characters are good. Story is good. History yeah. was good. Music History was, was good. 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 It's just my good game of this year. Mm-hmm. That and Arceus, though. You have it, probably not played more Legends Arceus. No, I don't yeah. like it. <laughs> so. I played it more. I mm. did been to it several times. It's uh, sexy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what about the new Pokemon game? Have you looked at it? Yeah, I saw it was announced like Violet Nexus. Nexus and Violet? Uh, pass. I think was it, it Scarlet was and Scar- Violet? Yeah, <laughs> Scarlet Nexus. <laughs> That's another <laughs> game. Yeah, I mixed it up. Sorry. Uh, yeah. I saw someone post that on Discord, and I thought to myself, "That is made in paint. That is <laughs> that is so not the the original logo. You mm. know the the yeah, yeah. actual title screen." Uh huh. Well, you know, I said the other day to somebody that um, you know, that like that the graphics might be better than Arceus, but considering they used two thousand and four graphics for Arceus, I mean, they there's nowhere to go but up. But up. <laughs> so, yeah. you know. I'm just assuming I'm just it like, assuming it is 3D, which yeah, we have yeah. to assume it will be. 
Yeah. I'm just yeah. thinking, oh my god, the, the yellowness in the title screen doesn't look not paint like made. Mm. I don't know, well, it was like I didn't believe it, but then I saw it was true. It was true. It's... <clears throat> true story, bro. Yeah. Maybe they've just given up on, you know, graphics <laughs> and textures. Up. Given up on life. <laughs> they've just <really>. given up. <laughs> but I think I think because we talked about when we talked about Arceus before, I've decided to say Arceus, by the way, because of the Arc phone. But yeah. Um, yeah. when we talked about it before. Uh, we said we said it's heading in the right direction with like or I said yeah. it's heading in the right direction I think Arceus is they have the concept down they just need to make it better than Arceus is kind of thing true but I think a little bit they're suffering from that they're trying to make these new 3D Pokemon games appeal to like too big an audience if you get what I'm saying like young people or people who are now old <laughs> yeah. who grew up with Pokemon who still play games like they want to make it appeal to them but then they also want to have it appeal to younger people like children or whatever so that Pokemon is still a children thing yeah and I think they're not really managing that by trying to like put these two things together it just makes a game that isn't fun for either group <laughs> <laughs> Does that make I, sense? I guess. I mean, I I didn't love Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl mm-hmm. because it was easily fied. It was simplified. <laughs> it was made more easy. Easily fied, as as you said, like yeah. applying to a younger audience. Kids. Mm-hmm. It's fun for kids though, but I'm not that much of a kid. Maybe <laughs> not that mostly, much. Of a kid. But did you not think that Arceus had some things that were like children oriented? No. I think it was more like a hardcore 30 plus male person. You think so? Yeah, I think so. Mm. It was super hardcore. <laughs> super hardcore. <laughs> I think there were some I think there were some elements. That that's what I mean. They tried to mix two things, like the boss battle type things. Uh, yeah, I didn't love the boss battles, but they were Yeah, short. but I feel like I feel like they're trying to like appeal to an older audience with that, but then like with walking around the, you know, frolicking around the meadow throwing Pokeballs. <laughs> Yeah. Like they're trying to appeal to a younger audience with that and it's like these two things like they should have made it one or the other I in my opinion i have 80 hours into the game already well maybe and you're a children i am a children <laughs> i love the game i said so i just love it i can't I explain it more than that yeah i mean this is my opinion obviously and i know very many people do love it i just i do not love I it. I find it so comfortable. <laughs> comfortable. It's <laughs> so comforting. It's just so comfortable. <laughs> it's, it's a comfortable game. Yeah. You know what's absolutely not comfortable? No. Elden Ring. <laughs> yeah. We can segue into that. Have you played it? I played it and it's so stressful. <laughs> Did you buy it? Yeah. And I'm so stressed. I haven't bought it yet. Where are you playing it? PC? Uh, this, uh, no, it doesn't have difficulty. No, PC. Oh, PC. I thought you said on easy. <laughs> I was like, it doesn't have to fill it. Where are you playing it? On, on easy? the Series X. <laughs> <laughs> on the yeah, Series true, X. True. So yeah. it's not on Game Pass then? No, no you have no. to buy it. Okay. At least I don't think so. I bought it anyway. Okay, so what do you think? <laughs> it's uh, stressful. Stressful. Like hard. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like not difficult. <laughs> I mean, not easy. It is difficult. Is it hard? I mean... I mean, it is Dark Souls, basically. So, yeah. you know, it's you, you die, which is, you know, the objective of the game kind of dying. thing. But it's just so stressful, like not knowing, like, if I'm going to survive or not. And I didn't <laughs> feel like this in Dark Souls. So I don't uh, know what it is about Elden Ring that just scares me. But I heard the world is nice. <laughs> it is. It is very nice. It's, I, I've been kind of running around in circles trying to avoid everything that looks like it's probably going to kill me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just yeah. looking at the scenery. Yeah. Oh, my God. I will I maybe like play it. I need like a good 10 minutes to like man up to like engage an enemy and then I engage it just to find out that I, they destroy me and then I go somewhere else and find an easier enemy and then I kill that and then yeah. I go back to the other one and then it still destroys me and I'm like oh no but isn't there like uh, isn't the game set up to be like you can build up your character become stronger and carefully approach the next one and the next one like, <laughs> well, I suppose but I've, I haven't really improved that much <laughs> yeah. like build up your character to be stronger yeah, like, I play really carefully I haven't done a lot of building to put okay. it that way <laughs> okay cute just, been, just my blood pressure is sky high this is like the first time that you have played a game that I haven't <laughs> <laughs> except for Astria Ascending never play that I did mm-hmm. try Lake the one that you recommended oh the did you first. yeah do you like it? <clears throat> it bugged out. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, okay. and I was like, oh. yeah, I did deliver a package and it was fun. It was nice. I will <laughs> play deliver more. Deliver a package. <laughs> I thought it was super cute. It was very relaxing and yeah, cute. Yeah, we'll, it was comfortable. <laughs> mm-hmm. Cute. Very comfortable. 
Cute. Yes. Will you Cute. play more Atelier Sophie too? Well, yeah, I'm going to finish it at oh, some point. Me, me, too. me too. Have you finished it? No, I'm near the end, maybe. <laughs> near the end, maybe. Yeah, but I'm like doing everything else than the main story. I'm like focusing on all the things like the side quests and the, the alternative story. Story. Mm-hmm. Story. And all the things. Just having fun. Yeah. Yeah, I'm taking it slow. I don't rush an Atelier game. I don't. Mm. <laughs> Can't rush perfection. <laughs> True. I did like about Sophie though, compared to Ryza too, that like um, the cutscenes that you get with your friends and stuff aren't as fucking grindy as they are in Ryza too. Yeah, like in Ryza too, you could spend hours in the city just going from area to area, hearing everybody's like four minute cutscene <laughs> per area. <laughs> yeah, they talked a lot. Yeah, it's a lot of talking. And Sophie, there there's still lots of story for the side characters, but they're a lot more, you know, snap Com- snap. Not compromised, compressed. <laughs> yeah, they make True. more sense, and they're not as long. They're not so as like disruptive. They're more funny, I think. Yeah, cute, yeah. cute, cute. We'll play okay. more. <laughs> Same. <laughs> that was a section of uh, how it is to YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened. <laughs> what happened? We spiraled it's, into where we have been it's Spiraled. It just uh, yeah. <laughs> ah, segue. Yeah. <laughs> Du sa sist, du sa, du må flyre mer inn i mikrofonen. Ja, yeah, f- I said last time, you have to laugh into the microphone. We need all the goodness. <laughs> yeah, I because travel you- away from the microphone to LOL in caps. <laughs> I travel, flight path. Yeah. It's like, do you remember that video of that guy singing Chocolate yeah. Rain when he <laughs> moves away from the microphone? That's the one. I move away from the microphone to breathe. It's me, IRL. <laughs> Chocolate Rain. Yeah. <laughs> Some stay dry and others feel the pain. Chocolate Rain. That was... So good, I remember it still. That was, that was like early video. YouTube. That was gold. It's that was, what was his name? Ty Ty Zonde or something like yeah. that. Gonna, <laughs> anybody, legend. Yeah, for anybody not alive in that time of the internet, you've really missed out. We're gonna link it on the Discord. One of one of the first memes, I guess, on YouTube. Really ancient. I was <laughs> in the notes. I almost wrote chocolate memes. <laughs> 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 chocolate. But it's a chocolate meme. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good video it's a good song good. yeah he moves away from the mic to breathe <laughs> what was the point what did you start saying uh already. where was i i don't know laughing into the microphone because yeah yeah okay. but i think i said something i don't know this, <laughs> this is disc it is yeah we so. don't know what we're doing okay <laughs> I think I'm wanna- starting to have corona symptoms. I feel a slight hotness. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you always? <laughs> I feel so. No, I may, I may be onto something. <laughs> I, think, I think I'm coming down with a fever, maybe. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, there's something called, like, something can be psychosomatic. Which yeah. means that you think. Yeah, what you do you know about that? About psychosomatic? Yeah. It's, what do you mean is there anything to know about it except for like somebody says like okay there's like d- you know scabies going around and then you're like oh shit and you start itching everywhere yeah you know yeah, suddenly you think you yeah, have it yeah. don't google like stomach cancer or anything because suddenly before you know it. <laughs> <laughs> true true did you know yeah. that you can be like placebo pregnant also <laughs> No, like this is what? true. This is true. No, so no. true. No, if, if you are a female, <laughs> preferably, <laughs> okay, and you think that you are pregnant, you're starting to feel pregnancy symptoms, and that is well, <laughs> what you said. What with what do you? Psycho, uh, psycho psychosomatic. Is oh, what def- it's called. definitely that. <laughs> <laughs> definitely <Yeah>. very that. <laughs> yeah, that is so true. That is that is a true thing. Actually, true. Yeah, actually, you know what I was reading about the we're totally getting off topic, but you know what I was reading about the other day, which yeah. is totally creepy. Well, um, the thing that's called like there's a I don't know if it's an illness, <laughs> some kind of psychiatric big issue. Wow, uh, Mun- Munchausen by proxy. Yeah, you heard yep. about that? That is fucking bonkers, but not yeah, crazy. It's bonkers, mate. <laughs> that is I know. Bonkers. Did you see what the is documentary the that? that is called? What was that donkey documentary? <laughs> documentary. <laughs> There's a big. How did you figure out? I I was go- I was just a uh, Wikipedia surfing trying to get to Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mönch- yeah, this is the story. Munchausen by proxy. The most known case was with that uh, mom and daughter. That and the mom said to everyone, "My daughter can't walk. Can't this and that." <gasps> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah and yeah, yeah. and like super Munchausen by proxy. Mm-hmm. which means uh you say someone is very ill with a lot or of ma- or even make them ill if you can yeah by, you yeah know, to get feeding them rat for poison yourself. yeah yeah oh that is that, the worst like, story what the kind worst. of person do you have to be to do that you know like Gyp- to... gypsy gypsy was her name okay i think the documentary <laughs> is called gypsy also okay maybe i'll look into it because i do remember that it's, a, it's an illness I think, yeah, but it's. I mean, it's just so Psycho. like. I mean, fair, like I'm, I'm. I was about to say fair enough, but you know, sort of <laughs> fair enough if you're like just telling people that whoever is sick, you know, and like if I was gonna start saying Patrick has cancer and it's just a terrible time, blah blah blah. Um, <laughs> but like, if I'm not like, and that's just a harner, hard, 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 harner, garner uh, sympathy. Um, yeah, and whatever. Sympathy. Yeah, that would be one thing. But if you're when you're like actively making somebody sick, like your child or your parent or your sister or your brother or your whoever. Yeah. Like that's sick. Yeah, it's like, sick. <laughs> super sick. I mean, did do you know how that story ended with a girl called Gypsy? I don't. I don't remember. But you can tell me. She murdered her mom. <gasps> so that really? Is how, yeah, that is how serious this is. Super serious. Jesus. She was, you know, mentally broken down from early age, and her mom had her teeth pulled out. It was just <laughs> a, the, the weirdest, sickest story. Sad story. Super sad. Mm-hmm. Uh, but yeah it's a thing it's sad really terrible terrible like, I... and uh, her mom made a living on making her daughter sick it's just so yeah. insane no like, like he, she didn't work so she made a living like money but this. you you kind of have to wonder like is it is was that the goal or was it just to get sympathy you know <laughs> The, the weird thing with Munchausen by proxy is that I don't think that the mom wanted to be a bad mom to her daughter or she was ob- oblivious to the fact that she was hurting her daughter. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think sort of. she didn't know how bad it was because that is a part of the illness sort of thing. I think that. But her daughter, uh, as she grew up and met a uh, guy online, according to the uh, documentary, Uh, she started to think for herself and think that oh my god my mom is sick i hate her i hate her guts and i want to kill her so then they did uh, the new (laughs) boyfriend and her sad sad story um i i don't know if i can recommend it but it's a sad story if you want to check it out check it out but i mean that seems like an overreaction like i mean i know it's sick but it's still an overreaction Mm. a little bit probably shouldn't murder so that, that was your anybody. random wikipedia fact of the day <laughs> <laughs> yeah i loved it okay what were we supposed to talk about <laughs> i don't remember but i also have some facts okay hit me I, I can hit you with one fact uh i wrote down there is a recent we there is yeah okay this one is good <laughs> there is a reason we want to squeeze cute things it's called cuteness aggression a little bit of <laughs> aggression helps us balance out that high really I don't have that. It's With cit- like... c- citation needed, please. Yeah, but is citation. that real? <laughs> I don't know. Cuteness aggression. Mm. I don't want to I mean, squeeze I d- anything. <laughs> I don't want to squeeze, but sometimes, like when I'm holding the kitten, I just want to, like, oh, do it. Yeah, know? yeah, that is cuteness aggression because it helps balance <laughs> off the high. I don't know. How is that really? Why. Is that really why? I don't know if that is true. <laughs> Citation <laughs> very needed. LOL. But I feel like isn't that something everybody does? You're just like, oh, it's just so cute. You just want to, you know. Yeah, I guess. Yes, I guess. <laughs> I guess. I guess so. Do you have any other facts that you can yeah. hit me with? Yeah, this one is good. We are convinced that the future is bright. <clears throat> I'm well, not. <laughs> I am Corona. <laughs> There's war. There's like, yeah, future is bright. Yeah, it looks. Super I don't. Bright. I don't know where I found this. I just found. Where it. did you find that? That's just <laughs> not where true. That. Okay, <laughs> this one is more true though. Our okay. brains want us to be lazy. Oh. is but that how but how i don't know how does that what? a brain wants us to be lazy i don't think so citation Maybe. needed <laughs> all of these are bad <laughs> i think i just google like random facts just to have something included for the podcast yeah, but wait if we try to think about this with our lazy brains how does that work it wants us to be lazy um, oh god i mean in <laughs> Oh God. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I mean, if you have everything, you know, layered out for you, set set out for you, if you have someone to cook and clean for you, 
and do everything for you. Isn't it more comfortable to just lie and <laughs> lie there and receive? <laughs> From the microphone, <laughs> <laughs> you totally fly path it away there for a second. <laughs> don't, don't, don't leave me. <laughs> Laugh into oh. it. <laughs> that was LOL capital letters. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> so you have a lot of experience with. <laughs> no, stop, stop it. Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> Oh no, rip. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh god. Okay, so didn't, yeah, even, didn't even get to say that's what she said. <laughs> we didn't get that far. <laughs> it's just easier. So yeah, that's why our brains wants us to be lazy. We have everything. We don't want to do anything. I don't know. <laughs> so, nee. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm over it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a good fact. That was a very good fact. <laughs> I, I, I love, I love, her. <laughs> yeah, I love receiving it, so to speak, <laughs> <laughs> so that your brain can be lazy. <laughs> yeah, love it. Exactly, I love it. <laughs> oh God, I'm crying. Okay. Uh, <laughs> do you have any? Do you have any? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have anything else? Yeah. I have three more, but I think two of two of them are bad. <laughs> so um, <laughs> well, this one was bad, but it turned out it was good. <laughs> it was good. <clears throat> I, I, I have, I'm gonna try to read it. It's a long segment. Memories okay. are like pee piece together pictures than accurate snapshots. Or more like, I mean. Yeah. Uh, that, well, that makes sense. This is about the false memories that we have already yeah. talked about. Uh, yeah. Even people with the best memories in the world can have false memories. The brain generally remembers the gist of what happens, then fills out the rest, sometimes inaccurately, which mm -hmm. explains why you insist your wife has was with you at the party six years ago, even though she wasn't or something. That was an <laughs> I example. thought you were going to say, I thought you were going to say, even though she's dead or something. <laughs> You insist your wife was at the party with you six years ago, even though she's dead. Even though she dead, <laughs> she received it. She she dead. <laughs> she just laid there. And she she received was receiving. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> she did. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> uh, okay. I'm sweaty. Full yeah. Corona. Crying. Oh God. <laughs> Rip. Same. Uh, okay that was all i, all I got <laughs> was that thought? i got it that was all i got was that it those were the facts <laughs> oh. we automatically second guess ourselves when other people disagree <clears throat> yeah so yeah you know i second guess myself even when i know i'm right sometimes <laughs> <laughs> because uh, patrick tiny hats man <laughs> says disagrees <laughs> no but sometimes you know when somebody asks something like somebody will be like uh oh god i can't think of anything super quickly um like ah. in the discord for example in the discord server somebody asks something about a game yeah they're like i can't think of an example of something somebody would ask and i know the answer but i'm kind of like ah uh, is that the right answer <laughs> even <laughs> though i know i'm right i'm just kind of like i don't want to like say it because i think maybe what if i'm wrong you know yeah, then you would be doomed <laughs> i second guess myself if like no, nobody has to second guess me i second guess myself before i even have time to be second guessed <laughs> But isn't your Twitter profile like I think I know things when I don't or something like that? Yeah, I, I think I know what I'm saying, but I don't. Yeah, that's the one. That's your profile yeah. text. It's on Instagram too. Yeah, yeah, it's just true. true. Or something like I'm sometimes neurotic or something. Oh yeah. Oh Was yeah. That you? <laughs> <I think laughs> that <the one? laughs> Is that me? You're uh, the one. I think so. Let me check. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh no yeah, yeah yeah no yeah the, on twitter it says hi i'm seen i like video games and being neurotic it's That's on instagram one. yeah it's on instagram it says i think i know what i'm saying but i don't <laughs> <laughs> do you always know what you're saying uh mostly not <laughs> mostly not <laughs> but you like to think that you do yeah did you not see in the disky disc uh, channel on, um on discord today yeah, somebody no. said Lis- listening to an old episode uh, and just and, and then in squiggly fingers and now nintendo's the whore quotation tiny hat <laughs> did you say that <laughs> apparently i don't know what the context was <laughs> i don't remember that we Same. say so many things we say too I many do. things i say too many things did you see that time. did you see that Isherman released a record <laughs> record an I album did. on I did. spotify i did uh like the jingle from the podcast saint yes Uppe. digital did. entropy I loved it. I love that tune. Uh-huh. Good tune. Jingle, I mean. <laughs> good tune, jingle. Yes. Ah, super good. We also reached 500 subscribers on Disky Disk. Yay! Yay! Cake. <laughs> cake. Cake emoji. Look. Cake emoji. Oh, definitely cake emoji. Capitalized cake emoji. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, what was this topic, really? Um. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? I don't know where we. We came were gonna from. wing. We go. We were gonna wing it. Um, when do we not? <laughs> we were. Yeah, true. Your car. Oh, <clears throat> right. That's <clears throat> story. Sorry. Story time. Yeah. Story time. Patrick crashed our car. <laughs> <laughs> I know it went well, but what? Yeah. I mean, we talk about cars a lot on this podcast. Have I you know. thought about that? <laughs> Christian car up. podcast. Confirmed. Yeah, Christian car podcast confirmed. Yeah, Patrick crashed the car. Not crash, crash, super crash. It was Not <laughs> his fault. Yeah, it was just a little... <clears throat> like a more, bump. Yeah, a bump more than a crash. But he came down the road. <laughs> <laughs> As you do. <laughs> As you do in the car. Uh, <laughs> and there's an intersection and he was go- like an X, like crossroad intersection. <laughs> an, X. <laughs> an X. And he was going straight uh, straight forward because he was coming to pick me up from work. Um, yeah. And there was a car coming down from the left, like on his left. So yep. that guy had to give him right of way. Uh, but that person did not. Did so, not. Did not. So they both tried to break, but then, you know, snow and whatever. So they all just, they both kind of like slid into <laughs> each other. <laughs> so he received he, it. He did receive it. <laughs> <laughs> he tried to stop it, but he couldn't. <laughs> so, I never trust people with the right of way when driving. I, know, I don't trust same. them. So he must have been really confident. I know. And I said, Patrick's it's going to be listening to this podcast and I'm sorry. Sorry. Um, no, he's a I good think, driver. I know that. Yeah. He is Mercedes. a good driver. But I think he drives too confidently. Too confident. Is that a thing? Yeah. Yeah. I think he's a little bit too much. You know, he thinks that this is going to be fine. And no, then... <laughs> maybe he thinks that other drivers are smart. <laughs> no. I think he just sees too, has too much confidence in the in the fact that nothing bad's gonna happen, kind of thing. And oh. also, you know, winter in Norway, we have like fucking six meter snowbanks, and true. you know, it's, it's true. slippy and all the stuff. So it like in no way was it his fault anyway. You yeah. know, yeah, that guy was obviously he was he was like eighteen. He got his driver's license like yeah. six months ago, and I'm yeah. like, okay, dude. <laughs> so. but shouldn't shouldn't he like? freshly come out of it and know what the right of way is when you've well, just re- received <laughs> yeah oh, no, when you've just God, received no. it yeah <laughs> <laughs> but, Lazy brain. yeah yeah but the thing is that like you know that's why insurance is more expensive for young people especially actually you know in a sexist way they're more expensive for young males than females yeah, in norway i know this because this yeah because they're more accident prone because yeah. boys are stupid um and <laughs> <laughs> Quote me on that one. Ninety <laughs> percent of the <laughs> listeners of this is for yeah. sorry, Boy, you're stupid. Love, love you, <laughs> love you. Um, but yeah, so that you know, that's why their insurance is more expensive because they're accident prone and they think they know everything and do everything correctly. <laughs> blah blah blah. Poor things. Oh yeah. no. <laughs> Poor no. things. Oh, no. <laughs> He was so sad too, because like I was waiting for Patrick to pick me up, you know, yeah. and he called me and he was like, I crashed and I had a, a heart attack and a stroke. And this is my ghost speaking right now. Oh, no. um, but it wasn't that far away from my work. So I walked over to where they were. It's like, yeah. a, I don't know, half a kilometer yeah. to walk or yeah. something. And I got there and they were just both like there. And, you know, and it was, uh, yeah, he was just a shy little boy, but not Patrick. I mean, the other guy. <laughs> Patrick was <laughs> suddenly shy little boy. <laughs> transformed yeah no but he was no just it's a... just terrible what did you do with the car 
Like, did, did I mean, it still it works. works. There's nothing wrong. We have to wait for the insurance. So, I mean, but we'll see because it's there's some stuff that's there's some wonky stuff and some. Right now, we've we've taken your advice and duct taped part of the like screen inside the wheel well <laughs> to yeah. the to the like frame of the car. My so, old car full of yeah. tape. So now we have a a duct taped car also. Cool. Yeah. yeah, I saw your car yesterday. I drove by. Our car? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> drove I by even, where? Here? Yeah, I did. And I rang the bell and no one was there. And I was like, oh, oh our God, doorbell doesn't you're pr- work. Probably ready. <laughs> our, no, our doorbell doesn't work. Oh, I didn't know that. But yeah. it was just random. I wasn't. When was it? <laughs> at the evening sometime, 10, I think. I, w- I didn't <laughs> want anything from you. <laughs> what was I doing yesterday? I don't know. The door was locked. Even. <laughs> I well, the door's to, always the door's always locked. I tried to barge in, but I couldn't. Yeah, but the door's always you have to call. Yeah, sorry. It was just <laughs> you know a my, random. You know, my stepdad did this exact same thing the other day. Oh, <laughs> he, he came over and rang rang the doorbell. Nobody answered. And he was like, okay, I guess they're not there. <laughs> I was just like, I was thinking that maybe you're just raiding in wow. Yeah. Well, just landing in wow. I mean, good thing you didn't come because you have COVID now. So yeah, yeah, I know, right? Good thing. It must yeah. have been fate. I did just say good thing you didn't come. So that's that <laughs> went under the radar completely. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> Shy little boy. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Well, um <laughs> Yeah, it's a good thing I didn't give you didn't receive. <laughs> it was good. It was good. I wasn't on the I wasn't in a receiving mood. The, yeah, you would have time. had COVID now, poor thing. Yeah. Boy. <laughs> I, I still I mean I still might because you know like I said we have patients that work with COVID and I was yeah. at work on Saturday and it, uh, you may have it I may I have you, been in you close will contact not, you will not be surprised I will not be surprised <laughs> <laughs> Wing it. <laughs> According <laughs> in progress. <laughs> actually, I have to you stop know, saying that. <laughs> but you know, actually, now in this little segue, I went to pee and I went to check the doorbell and it does work. You just have to press it seriously hard. <laughs> okay. Oh, well. I'll, I'll remember that. The good yeah. thing I didn't press it hard yesterday. You do have to press super hard. <laughs> so, sometimes it's better to go hard, you know? Yeah, but it's a good thing that I didn't. It's not always good to go hard. <clears throat> uh, sometimes. Yeah, so. sometimes. Sometimes. Just not, not when COVID is COVID. We have a topic. I have a topic. Okay. You're like, find a topic while I pee. And I'll, yeah. yeah. So the topic is how do we see ourselves with age? How, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> what do you mean? So how old do you feel or see yourself how, if you're like, if you're, if you didn't have an age, let's say, if you were a spirit, <laughs> like 17, maybe. <laughs> yeah. You feel 17. I feel sometimes in like, my how life. How do you I view feel, yourself? I mean. I feel Sorry. like I'm so clueless that I might as well be 17. Yeah. How old do I feel? I feel like I'm in my 20s somewhere, some, somewhere, floating well, around. Not, <laughs> floating I mean, you're not, you're not that far away. <laughs> I'm floating on maybe, I, I remember, 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 <laughs> bad. <laughs> <laughs> I remember, uh, for several, for, <laughs> for several, several. <laughs> For several years. Are you from Norway? Do you suddenly come from Norway? <laughs> Hello? Are you okay? <laughs> That's racist against Norwegians. <laughs> but loud. <laughs> LOL caps lock. <laughs> um, I'm sweaty. So <laughs> I okay. remember for many years that I thought of myself as for when for, for <laughs> forever 21. As oh, in the, the store, <laughs> the store, Christ. clothing store that's called Forever 21. I'm like, yeah, uh, that's me, that's the one. Nice. Oh, what a terrible shit. age to be forever. Jesus, I would never want to be Forever 21. Yeah, terrible. I terrible hated age. being 21. <laughs> I feel 20, 27 was good, I think. Why can't you just feel how old are you? 31. <laughs> <laughs> so I had to think for a second. You're too. You're like yeah. Two. Why can't we also both of us feel the age that we <clears throat> are? Yeah, I feel good with with my age. I feel right? very good. <laughs> it's a good age. The thing yeah. is, I don't. I'm not scared of age, <clears throat> um, oh. aging or age in general. I used to be. I used to be terrified. I remember my twentieth birthday. I was like, oh God, now I'm old. 
I remember you used to not want to say how old you are on YouTube too. Yeah. I remember. Uh, I still feel you, the cringe when you were in Sweden. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I remember you said you were like, "Let's not tell them how old we're." <laughs> yeah, and we were twenty three, and I was embarrassed by being twenty twenty three. No, because... when you were in Sweden, no, we were like twenty six. No, four. Really? Yeah. Okay. Tw- twenty three or twenty four, but yeah, I was embarrassed by age, and that has changed with age. Isn't was that, that because so was that because you thought 24 was old or because yeah. you thought it was young you thought it was old, old? yeah old. <gasps> oh no come on i was young when i thought that <laughs> yeah exactly <laughs> how is that old that's the weird thing no you're i don't basically know basically a fetus when you're 24 no <laughs> offense to people who are 24 <laughs> I know. when someone that are 18 joined the discord server <laughs> you're like oh you're a little baby oh baby <laughs> but when Children. you were 16 you knew everything in oh, life yeah. do you remember Definitely. how life experienced we were yep very we thought incredibly. we had figured it all out mm-hmm. but that is just how we saw the world when we were 16 i mean that's how every 16 year old sees the world <laughs> we knew everything <laughs> this is it no it is yep. not. When... I'm so glad that wasn't it too. <laughs> so glad we didn't know everything. <laughs> God damn. At which age do you think you landed in yourself spiritually? Squiggly fingers. <laughs> <laughs> landed in yourself. <laughs> you received. <laughs> landed. I received. <laughs> yeah. Um, do you have like the, the age where you were like, oh, now I'm good. <laughs> like... Now... <laughs> Well, now, now I'm good. Okay. <laughs> now I'm good. From now on, everything is good. Yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, confidence comes with age. Definitely did with me. I was yeah. not confident before. Well, would you? What would you say? I would say like maybe last week. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no. No. What would you say though? Today. <laughs> I would Just say now. when your COVID test was positive. <laughs> and this is it. No, around the age of 25, when I landed squiggly mm. fingers in myself. <laughs> that, that's younger Mentally. than I would say. Like if I, yeah. If I was going to answer the question honestly, I would say 27. Yeah. I mean, it's an ongoing progress, isn't it? <laughs> Process. Yeah. Ask me again in 10 years. <laughs> it was like, I was a baby when I was 30. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Knew nothing. Yeah. Yep. It's an ongoing thing. But like, mm, what? <laughs> Uh, I feel 25 yeah 26 was also you know that is when you start to you know not give a shit <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I actually feel... that was from birth in my case but still... <laughs> yeah, okay, that was from 25 from my case uh. <laughs> <laughs> you care less about what other people think do you feel yeah, like I'm you like... like don't respect younger people or like do you have negative feelings towards younger people or is that just me? <laughs> that is definitely not not <laughs> I mean just you. <laughs> I mean I don't mean to alienate everybody who's young. I love everybody. No. <laughs> <laughs> good good one. <laughs> no, good but one. I mean like when <laughs> no can I... No, no, I don't mean I dislike, I don't dislike younger people. I just mean, like, whenever I talk to somebody who is younger, I automatically assume that they're more of a moron than I assume everybody to be. If that makes sense. Maybe you could, like, if you meet a 16 year old, you could sort of subconsciously assume that that 16 year old is at the the (laughs) mental stage where you were at 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 16, which makes sense because that is what we we think about when we think about 16. It's like we compare it with how we were at that age. Yeah. Yeah. And a lot of older older people, older people also (laughs) do that. They say, like, when I was in my 20s, I did that (laughs) and that. It's like that is the thing that everyone yeah asks. no but I just mean I don't mean like that I dislike people for their age I'm just saying when I meet somebody who is younger yeah. they sort of have to like prove themselves <laughs> in a way <laughs> but, but I'm not joking <laughs> like, <it's> actually, <laughs> I just automatically assume <laughs> that maybe they're stupid so like until proven that they're not stupid I'm kind of apprehensive does that make sense <laughs> that's you <laughs> I love I'm trying to explain it in the most like humane way I possibly can. I'm not saying I hate everyone. I mean, I sort of do, but like, I... no, you make sense. You do make sense. Yeah. yeah. I it's interview just... a lot of teenagers. You know? Oh God. I do. I talk I a lot with teenagers. Yeah. But like, I. 
I, I like it. Sometimes I'm just surprised by how smart they are. I know. Maybe and that's when I, I really hate that. I really hate it when I meet They're a younger so person and I like them. <laughs> then I'm like, they're so woke, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're smarter than I think I was at that time. Well, I, I mean, know. that doesn't take much. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> True, it doesn't. No. Yeah, I mean, like, they are, they are doing their makeup down at the age of nine nowadays. Sweet. Like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> and, like, they have the perfect sort of makeup also. I mean, we, we did not. They have YouTube what do you tutorials mean? now. We didn't we have dream. YouTube tutorials. <laughs> yeah, but we have, we have Dream Map Moose as a powerful tool. <laughs> yeah, black eyeliner. Yeah. True. Remember when we had like gym at school and like <laughs> one girl had a lip gloss and a oh, yeah. pink <laughs> eyeshadow yeah. and every girl borrowed yeah. some. Yeah. We I remember especially gym. like when we had swimming, like yeah. when, you know, mm-hmm. we went to yeah, Gothenburg. That, that yep. was I remember the mirror too that everybody used. Oh, everyone used to say, went on rotation. <laughs> <laughs> every single girl in that school bought uh, pink uh, eyeshadow. Same God. thing. Yep. <sighs> Terrible. Fun times. That was the first makeup. Yeah. <laughs> first experience with makeup. We were like what? Twelve. Uh twelve, probably, yeah. yeah. When did you so when did you discover eyeliner, would you say? Late twelve. <laughs> That's <laughs> late twelve. <laughs> it's a same. Thing. Yeah. 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 And we then you late. wore wore we were, a lot of it. Yeah, we but we were a class that was late on the makeup trend because we were like big dot. <laughs> out, out the, how do you say that yeah like not in the city we went to school outside of the city we really... so you think we would have worn makeup <laughs> if we'd gone to school yeah and... yeah i really don't think i remember so. the trends in, in in the city they were earlier there with makeup what? and smoking i did not we were slower <clears throat> so what the the was slower. hey excuse me i got like the first time <laughs> i got drunk i was like 12 <laughs> jesus i thought that was with me Weren't we like 12, 13? We weren't much older. We were, I know this by heart. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we were 14. We were not. We, we were, were younger so than that. We so 14. We were so We felt younger. younger. <laughs> we felt younger, but we were 14. No way. That would have been like ninth grade. No, I know. I remember because that is the year that I you came, said came that. Back. You said that about your birthday last episode <laughs> and you were wrong. <laughs> <laughs> false memories <Yeah>. yeah. <laughs> we were definitely not in ninth grade i can promise you that i wasn't there in ninth grade because <laughs> i know in ninth grade you know i was friends with beep out the name uh, yeah and i know that at that point <laughs> you know. it would have been i would have been a different <laughs> set of circumstances you would have been a different person <laughs> a different person yes <laughs> <laughs> yeah but we were young we were young no, or old <laughs> I would say like 13, 14 is pretty young. <laughs> Did you know that 100 years ago kids used to drink coffee? <laughs> I learned I learned <laughs> I learned that on the farm TV show. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. This is where you're getting your facts. <laughs> I know from the farm no. TV show. And I I mean it's, I don't even know how to I don't even know what to do with you right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <it's>... Ah, okay. <clears throat> All right. So <laughs> <laughs> this is this is it really. <laughs> that, was, that was it really. <laughs> do you have anything else on your mind or are you currently playing anything? I mean what Did is we up? already talk about all those? I wanna just I <laughs> I mean, I would like to say, again, I don't hate young people. <laughs> this is not the hill I want to die on. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you won't. Every, everybody who's under 30 listening to this kid is going to be like, this fucking bitch. <laughs> you, also, like... you also said that boys are stupid earlier. Oh, oh, true. Well, I'm sorry to all young people and boys. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry to all the boys. <laughs> <laughs> oh i have covid oh no yeah, yeah you do it's true what? you do i didn't what? sign up for this well you kind of did you're alive <laughs> true <laughs> it's gonna be fine <laughs> i hope well yeah it's gonna be fine hello
I think we should cut that out. Yeah, I completely okay. agree. Ska vi avsluta podcasten här? Ja, ska vi göra det? Ja, that was uh, that was all <laughs> that was all really. <laughs> Thank you for listening to Desk and Dash. <laughs> to Desk and Dash podcast. This has been like the most chaotic episode in history of this podcast. <laughs> It's because you got a beer and I got COVID. Yeah. <laughs> because, <laughs> because I got a beer and you got COVID. <laughs> yeah. oh, no. I think I have like fever laughs or fever hallucinations or whatever now. <laughs> I'm on a super high. <laughs> Same, really. High from Every COVID. day. Really. Oh no. I've had uh, now. I've had two beers, so I feel like we <laughs> should not be at this decibel. At this point. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> Three yeah. things for this kid. <laughs> <laughs> true. True. This was uh, episode eleven. Yes, it was. Oh, the sweatiest by far so far. We say that every episode. <laughs> Imagine if she sold 100. We were not going to die. We're going to be so sweaty. <laughs> oh, should we just end it? Yeah. We end. <laughs> I mean, if anybody made it this far, congratulations. <laughs> Thanks for listening. And comment on YouTube's. Yeah. Uh, and join the Discord. Yeah, the disky Discord. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much for listening and we will see you next week. Bye. Every, every week. Bye. 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 Oh. Sweat. Oh. <laughs> 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 now we have to take us together here, or else it becomes like a chaotic beginning, and then we go in for feedback and then it's like that. As all the time ever. Every week. Vi må ha start nå det. Ja, okej. Okay. Jag måste bara slappa lite av i tryna med det. <laughs> Nej, det måste vi inte.